कि यू आर एजुकेट एंड ऑर्गेनाइज है With this inspiration lines by B. R. Ambedkar, I am Rose Pinky Corbin from Grade Seven B, along with my friends. Welcome you all to this beautiful morning assembly. Today is the one thirtieth year of our Ambedkar Jayanti. On this special day, let's imbibe Ambedkar's quality of thinking and ideas of equality in our life. As we all know, we are facing a new variant of COVID-19 named Omicron. So we shall pray together to survive this situation. Let us start with a prayer. Prayer. Oh my God, I offer you in this day. I believe in you. I love you. I hope in you. Bless me to be good and help me to be kind to all. Bless my studies. I pray to thee to enlighten my mind that I may know more clearly. Strengthen my memory and direct my will towards what is right. Bless my father and mother, my brothers and sisters, my teachers, and all my fellow men. Amen. The shabby showers of blessing. This is the promise of love. The shabby seasons refreshing. Sent from the saints in your bow. Showers of blessing. Showers of blessing. Rounders are falling, but for the showers we plead. The shabby showers of blessing, precious reviving again. Over the hills and the valleys, sound of abundance of rain. Show. The reading from the Holy Gospel according to Saint Luke, chapter one, verses forty-six to fifty. And Mary said, "My soul magnifies the Lord, and my spirit leaps for joy in God my Savior." For he has looked with favor on the humility of his handmaid. For behold, from this time all the nations shall call me blessed, for he was great has done great things for me, and holy is his name. And his mercy is from generation to generations for those who fear him. This is the word, sir. Lord, Amen. Omicron is a variant of COVID-19. It spreads faster than Delta. Omicron was first reported in South Africa on 24 November 2021 and gets spread around 38 countries. On 26 November 2021, WHO named it Omicron. India has reported some cases of Omicron virus a few weeks before, which is an alarming situation. Thus, prevention measures must be taken, which are as follows: keep a physical distance of at least one meter, wear a well-fitting of mask, keep your hands clean, and get vaccinated. Prevention is always better than cure. Good morning to all. Today's word: amiable. Spelling. A M I A B L E, amiable, meaning having or displaying a friendly and pleasant manner. Sentence: She is a girl of amiable nature. Thank you. Pledge: In this my country, all Indians are my brothers and sisters. I love my country and I am proud of its rich and varied heritage. I believe in universal amity and religious harmony. I shall always strive to be worthy of it. I shall give my parents, teachers, and all elders respect and treat you with courtesy. To my country and my people, I pledge my devotion in their well-being and prosperity alone lies my happiness. Good morning, friends. Today's thought: Our future depends on what we do in the present. I repeat: Our future depends on what we do in the present. Thank you. Hello, good morning to all. I myself am Namini C of Gate 7B. Today I am going to say about Dr. B. R. Ambedkar. 
The full name of Dr. B. R. Ambedkar is Dr. Bhim Rao Ramji Ambedkar. He was born in 14 April 1891. He was an Indian jurist, economist, and social reformer who fought economic and social discrimination against the untouchables in India's Hindu society and who later renounced Hinduism and inspired the Dalit Buddhist movement. Ambedkar served as chairman of drafting committee of the Constitution of India and Minister of Law and Justice in the first cabinet of Jawaharlal Nehru from 1947 to 1951. He is also referred to by the honorific Baba Saheb. Ambedkar was a prolific student earning doctorates in economics from both Columbia University and the London School of Economics gaining a reputation as a scholar for his research in law economics and politics in his early career he was an economist professor and a lawyer his later life was marked by his political activities he became involved in campaigning and negotiations for india's independence publishing journals advocating political rights and social freedom for dalits and contributing significantly to the establishment of the state of india in 1956 he converted to buddhism initiating mass conversion of dalits in 1990 bharat ratna india's highest civilian award was posthumously conferred on ambedkar he had died on 6 december 1956 thank you Chennai's Communist Party shows democracy by its myth. Chennai's Communist Party has taken American democracy to task, sharply criticizing a global democracy myth being hosted by President Joe Biden next week and extolling the virtues of its governing system. Air India Delhi Newark flight returns midway due to medical emergency. An Air Indian flight, which had been taken off from Delhi Airport early on Thursday, returned after finding a bat on board. This district in Tamil Nadu has had to close shops, public places were unvaccinated. A week stem has been given to the residents of Madurai in southern Tamil Nadu by the district administration for getting at least one dose of the COVID-19 vaccine, following which those unvaccinated would be barred entry from public places and commercial establishments. Our sent standard students board exam is almost done. I hope they write well and get good marks. Thank you. Have a nice day. सुप्रभात सबको भारतीय सेना दिन की हार्दिक बधाई देते हूँ सशस्त्र झंडा दिवस हर साल 7 दिसंबर को पूरे देश में मनाया जाता है खासतौर से भारत की तीनों सेनाओं में यह दिन विशेष रूप से मनाया जाता है तेईस अगस्त उन्नीस को केंद्रीय मंत्रिमंडल की रक्षा समिति ने युद्ध दिग्गजों और उनके परिजनों के कल्याण के लिए 7 दिसंबर को झंडा दिवस मनाने का फैसला लिया मेरा प्रिय दोस्तों सबको भारतीय सेना दिन की हार्दिक बताया देता हूँ धन्यवाद ജനഗണമന അതിനായക ജയഹേ ഭാരത ഭാഗ്യ വിദാദ പഞ്ചാബ് സിന്ധു ഗുജറാത്ത് മലാസ്ത്രാവിഡ ഉത്കല ഗംഗ വിങ്ങ ഹിമാചലയ മുനാ ഗംഗ ഉച്ചല ജലതി തരംഗ തവ ശുഭനാമേ ജാഗേ തവ ശുഭ 
शिष्यमागे गाहे तव जय गादा जन गिन मंगल राय गज हे भारत भाग्य विदादा जय हे जय हे जय हे जय जय जय